everybody, it's Gamaragi. Come over here, quick. We're gonna talk to this guy. But, uh, don't tell him we're gonna talk to him. We're back with Dark Souls. Uh, last time we got over here. We're almost to the first Bell of Awakening at the top of a church. Uh, but first, we need to deal with some stuff. Starting with talking to this very, very busy man. How you doing, busy man? Well, you must be a new arrival. I'm Andre of Astora. If you require smithing, then speak to me. Andre of Astora. This guy is awesome. He's just awesome. Hurrah! Ooh, I got a, I got a, like a cheer thing, finally. Sweet. Most weapons and armor are mighty sturdy indeed. But every hunk of metal has its breaking point. If you notice durability running low, it's time to repair. You can ask a blacksmith like myself, or do it on your own with a grindstone. The nice thing about weapons, they never betray you. So pay them a little respect, eh? Well, that's very sound advice there, man. Uh, there are some weapons that do hurt you when you use them. I count that as betrayal, personally. I don't want to use those, they're mean. There are two types of weapon forging. There's reinforcement and there's ascension. Reinforcement is simple. It strengthens the weapon and nothing more. A simple task for any blacksmith. Hell, you could even do it yourself with a smith box. But ascension's a finer art. It alters the weapon's properties. Ascension is the territory of we blacksmiths. A smith box just won't do the trick. Start out with reinforcement. When that loses its charm, you can consider ascension. As you've noticed, this land is flush with the mad and wicked. You won't make it through the night without employing my services. <laughs> okay, Santa. Man, I don't, I don't want to call everybody Santa. There's just so many Santa Clauses in this game. It's crazy. Hmm. You can forge armor just like you do weapons. Forging armor is even easier than forging weapons. Whether you forge weapons or armor first, well, that's up to you. But nobody wants to see you go hollow. So whatever you do, you'd better do it well. <laughs> Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, personally, I think upgrading your weapons first would be a better idea. Because <laughs> doing... If you can kill them before they do damage to you, it's... Uh, that's a good idea. And armor... Uh, I don't know. Because you're going to be finding new armor throughout the whole game. I don't know. It's totally up to, <laughs> up to you. You take a lot of damage whether your armor is upgraded or not. Hmm. What, but so. <laughs> okay. Well, that's all he's gonna say. So, uh, say. A uh, so. First, let's repair everything. Should not forget that. Okay, we are gonna reinforce this weapon, hopefully to plus five. Uh, before we fight this next boss, I'm gonna need a lot of Titanite shards, though. Okay, I think I'm gonna need. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I might need seven. I don't know if I can afford that many, honestly. Nope. I can only get five. Uh, let's get four. This guy also sells really good stuff. Uh, we're gonna need this crest of Artorius. So at some point, we're gonna need to get twenty thousand souls to pay for this. Uh, and then these are also really useful, so I'll probably get all of these. Weaponsmith box lets you upgrade your weapons, or uh, reinforce them, I guess. Yeah, it says <laughs> reinforce right there. Uh, and also you can reinforce your own armor at a bonfire, and you can also uh, repair all your stuff, which is all really useful. So this is definitely the first thing I'm going to try to get once I upgrade this weapon. And then he sells a whole bunch of weapons. That's interesting. I think these are fist weapons. I, you know, I haven't really seen anybody use fist weapons. Such short range that 
Oh man, that'd be hard to do. <laughs> and there's a whole bunch of uh, arrows and bolts. Okay, so we bought all the uh, things, titanite shards. Now we can upgrade this even more. Okay, so it's plus three. I'm gonna need. Oh man, it looks like I'm gonna need like three more titanite shards. Bummer. <laughs> it's a lot of souls. We might get it pretty soon uh, here. We will see. Okay, thank you. Don't get yourself killed. Neither of us want to see you go hollow. You are correct, sir. I do not want to go hollow. Okay. So now that's over with. Uh, I'm going to do something really foolish, guys. And I know I said I didn't want to do this right now, but I'm going to do it. I'm going to revive and kindle this. Uh, well... No, never mind. Change my mind again. I'll do it when we're about to fight uh, the next boss. Because <laughs> I don't know what's going to happen over here. It could, I could end up dying and I would be very unhappy. <laughs> it's not hard to farm more humanity, but it is kind of a pain in the butt. Hello. Stab right in the back. Woohoo! Look how much damage we're doing now, buddy. Oh, you guys better look out. Gonna drink? Gonna drink? Gonna drink? Yep. Shouldn't have done it. If they're backing away like that, that usually means they're gonna drink some Estus. <laughs> be wary of Caster. Yeah. Okay, so this room is gonna be kind of crazy. Uh, there's a huge knight on the right side that we have to fight, and there's also a caster up in the up in the peanut section up there that's going to shoot us if we try to fight in the middle of this room. So, we'll try to bring this guy out here. Hello. This guy is not a pushover. So hopefully I don't die. But, I mean, it's not that far of a run back. <laughs> it's not that, not that bad. Okay. You take very little damage, Sir Knight. Woo! Watch it there. And you can't backstab this guy. Or parry him, I don't think. That's why I typically don't parry things, because... Ugh. Ow. Ow. I don't know what I can parry. What are you doing there? What are you doing there? You missed. God, that's a big shield, man. How can you even hold that? Oh, no you don't. Woo! Ow. Ow. Stop it. Ugh. Ugh, oh, thank you. Ooh, another shard. Nice. Now we only have to afford two. And I almost have enough souls to do so. Okay. Uh, let's see if we can spot that caster. Oh, there it is. He's got like a, a trident with candles on it. Oh, you're a jerk. I think that's called a channeler. They're pretty violent, so. Anyway, I'm going to kick his butt, but first, I'm going to open up this shortcut here. Oh, or go on it. Why not? See where it goes. <laughs> I think you can get out of it in time, so you don't have to sit through this. Oh, look at this. Oh. Butamus. Where we are, guys. Firelink Shrine. That's right. That, man, look how crazy of a shortcut that is. It's nuts. Let's see how Petrus is doing. How you doing? Oh, hello. Hello. I will teach you miracle. Oh. Okay. 
come again. The yeah, yeah. Strength of your miracles depends on your faith. Petrus. Such a racist. How you doing, man? Don't you ever think to forge your weapons? You'd better find a smith box soon. Unless you enjoy swinging about with blunt instruments. <laughs> <laughs> How did that silly sorcerer's apprentice end up? Who? You know, the one always prattling on about Master Logan. He left for the undead burg, but never came back. Serves him right. If even old Big Hat can't make it out there, what chance does he have? I hope he enjoys his new life as a hollow. Hmm. Apparently some sorcerer apprentice dude is stuck in Undeadburg. So, we'll have to keep an eye out for him. Hmm? What? Oh, that's all we need. Another inquisitive soul. Well, listen carefully then. One of the bells is up above in the undead church, but the lift is broken. You'll have to climb the stairs up the ruins and access the undead burrow through the waterway. The other bell is back down below the undead burg, within the plague-infested blight town. But i die again before I step foot in that cesspool. <laughs> oh, me too. Blight town is not a happy place. Bloody hell, what is it now? You ask too many questions. Yeah, I know. I'm an inquisitive soul, what do you want? Okay, so that's about all that's going on over here. See you guys later. See you guys later. Okay, man. I love this shortcut. This is good. Good, good, good. Now let's see if we can kick that Chandler's hindquarters. Hopefully not die. I have died many times trying to get past this freaking guy. Not this guy, but the other guy. Oh. Woo! Haha. Uh -huh. Got you, Balder Knight. Alright, there he is. You can see him through the window. Uh, he actually has a whole bunch of little dudes protecting him, so we're gonna have to kill them first. Oh no, he's buffing them. He's buffing them right now! Come on over. What the heck? How did they not aggro? I was like right there. Hello. Oh my! Calm your butts! Need to get them away from him. Hello. Ow. These guys can hurt. Lots of enemies in one place is a very bad situation. Woo! Luckily they go down in one. Uh oh. Okay. I think we got them all. Woo! Yeah, they can they can really mess you up. Come here, Mr. Chandler. I want to show you something. It's called my blade. Uh oh, this is a bad place to be. Looks like we got some company now. I'm gonna run over here. <laughs> I probably shouldn't have fought him so close to the edge. <laughs> oh my god, I got all three? Are you joking? Oh, this is going to be bad. Oh, no. Oh, God. I'm going to die. 
<laughs> okay then. All right. Well, let's uh, try that with a little bit more, a little bit better tactic. Oh my, that was terrible. Okay. Well, I'm not gonna cut this out. Let's just go back there. So you can see what happens when you die. See, I have no souls and no uh, humanity in the upper left. But, if I go over here where I died, I should be able to pick it up and get it all back. Come here, Archer. Come here. That's it. Thank you. Oops. Well, that works. Sometimes I don't even realize what I'm doing until it's already done. <laughs> I'm not the best at this game. Okay. So the big dude is uh, still dead. A lot of the big enemies don't uh, respawn. Just oh, thank the Lord for that. <laughs> if you had to fight him every time. Oh my, that was close. Do something. Attack me. Chandler is... He parried me? Oh man, that was really scary. Drink. No, oh, you're just gonna die then. Okay. Oh man, I didn't know they could parry you. It's terrifying. Okay. I gotta fight these little dudes again. Come on out, dudes. Hopefully I can get him out here before they... He buffs them! Uh-oh. Ooh! Front and center! Yikes. Uh, I'm scared. Oh, now he's buffing them. Okay, well, at least he's dead. And he dies forever, too, so. Look at this three stooges. Can't get through the door. Oh, yeah. Swipe fest. Ouchie! That hurts. That hurt a lot. Whew! Oh, we did it. Man. <laughs> that was a challenge. Okay. Look at that view, man. This is a nice church. Okay, we got one more Baldur Knight I want to deal with. And then I'll go back and upgrade my sword, prepare for the boss. Oh, man! I'm being really risky. I could try to parry this guy, but I'm afraid I'm gonna f screw it up. He's gonna moy to me. Oh! God, I'm so bad. Oh, no, no, no! Here. Stop it! Stop it! You jerk. Okay. <laughs> Dag Balder Knight? Ah! doing in that barrel? Oh. Oh, you're dead. Ooh, humanity. Wonderful. Don't mind if I do. Okay, we can actually break this door back here. Hello? Who are you? Oh. Still human, are you? Then I am in luck. Could you help me? As you can see, I am stuck without recourse. Hmm. Yeah. Surely are. There you go, buddy. That's where the mystery key went. Hmm. Thank you. Yes. 
Sincerely, I am Knight Lautrec of Karim. I truly appreciate this, and I guarantee a reward. Only later. Later? Yes, very sorry. Your reward will have to wait. I've just been freed. Allow me some time. Okay. You better give me something. Lautrec. Lautrec of Karim. It's a really cool name. But that guy, he ain't so cool. Especially because he didn't give me a present. What a jerk. Okay, so if we head over here, uh, we could actually fight the boss. It's right up there. I'm not going to do that right now. Because <laughs> that boss uh, will kick my hiney right quick. In fact, I don't, I've don't. i never beaten that boss by myself. Like, it, Well, okay, that's not entirely true. I, I think I did beat it by myself on New Game Plus, but you have pretty good equipment in that. So I did a lot more damage. But just New Game, I have not beaten them. Or, uh, 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 I should say that boss. Man, I completely blew that. <laughs> kind of spoiled that. Spoiled. Sorry. Sorry. But anyway. Yeah. That's a hard boss. So I'm probably going to summon uh, Solaire to help me. Because he is awesome. First, I want to upgrade this sword. Well, are you need. Yes, I do. Okay, I need three Titanite shards. Oh yeah. So level uh, or plus five is the highest we can we can make it, but it's quite a bit stronger now. Go get yourself killed. Neither of us want to see you go hollow. That is the truth. So see, it has 123 damage now. Oh yeah. Good, 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 good. Um, how much was his uh? That repair box? Is it 2,000? Okay. I think it is. So we're gonna use some of these souls. I don't know how much these give. Oh. There we go. Well, you need. I would like to purchase your repair box. Thank you. I'll get these later. Uh, they're not as big of a deal because most of the time you need Titanite shards or some other kind of shard to upgrade your stuff and you can buy them from the blacksmith so you know trying to upgrade your stuff on your on your own at a bonfire you kind of have to have all that Titanite shard and stuff. Go get yourself killed. Neither. So yeah. Not, not as big of a deal. But, uh, yeah, 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 we're ready to go. I think we're ready to go. We can fight the boss. Um, but like I said, I'm going to uh, summon Solaire to help me with the boss because, oh my god, it's hard. Ugh, it's so hard, man. It's so hard. Okay, well anyway, I'm going to end it here, guys. Uh, I don't know how, part, how long this part has been. Man, I don't know. I'm having a lot of trouble talking in this LP. I don't know why. Maybe it's just today. I went. Yeah, I don't know. Ugh, whatever. A lot of trouble talking. Anyway, next time we're uh, we're gonna summon Solaire. We're gonna take on the boss of the church, and uh, we're gonna ring our first bell of awakening. So yeah. See you guys then.